What's going on, guys? We're here in Ottawa for the first week of Volleyball Nations League action here with team captain of Team Canada, Mr. Nikita Hogue. And Nick, you've been on this team for a long time. Yeah. How different is this year's version of Team Canada than the one we've seen for the past decade? Uh, a lot of new names, a lot of lot more energy. Guys are quite young, and, and I'm not used to that, so I'm still uh, still getting used to it. I mean, it's, it's a lot of fun, though, like trying to lead these guys and become better players and and giving as much of my knowledge as I can to those guys. Um, they're really excited to play international ball, and it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of fun. You were one of the young guys before, you know, go back to 2013, Canada's first World League. You were, I mean, you stepped off the World League court, went straight to the Canada Games as as 20 or 21. Can you remember being that young and being on this team and being able to help some of these younger guys kind of join that, you know, the professional pathway in the international game? Oh, yeah, for sure. I remember clearly my first time stand, like stepping in the court. It was the third set against the United States in the finals, and I was playing as an opposite. And I was like, well, I have nothing to lose. Nobody knows me, and I just went out and tried my best. But now that I have acquired all that experience throughout the last 10 years, now I can help those young guys and try to accelerate that growth uh, in the next few months and, and, and hopefully for the next three years and, and beyond that. We saw, you know, a few guys from the, the past regime, you know, Gord and Graham and, and Steve all kind of step away from the national team. What made you make that decision to stay with the national team? Uh, I feel good. I'm, I'm, I'm not 30 yet. I'm 29. So I have another another quad and it's a short quad this year. So it was, uh, I mean, I love this program so much. I, in my mind, I didn't really want to retire after Tokyo uh, from the national team. I, I still have some a lot of juice in me. So like, I'm ready to go for another three years, and uh, after that, we'll see. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll see after that. You know, a lot of talk around around this team and in a new system. It looks like there's learning being done everywhere. There's young guys coming into the program, but there's also the old guys who are adjusting from the the old style of play to the new style of play. What's that transition like, and what's it been like in the gym training so far to get ready for that? I've been I've start, started about three weeks three weeks ago coming back from my pro season. Uh, the first week, I felt like I didn't know how to play volleyball because it was so new. Uh, learning all the new the new stuff uh, he wants to implement in the system and uh, but it's been it's been a lot of fun I mean if anything I'm just going to become a better player at running those patterns right so uh, uh, my mindset is all is all with the staff and and and, and the team is is uh, especially the new the, the the new guys kind of are used to it a little bit more and then the old guys are kind of more used to a standard kind of offense so uh, we're kind of trying to meet in the middle and then now it's going much better we saw it we saw it against our against France the second game uh, our offense can be pretty lethal. So uh, if we keep if we keep receiving like we did against France, I think we'll we'll uh, we'll do a lot of damage out there. What kind of expectations do you think this team should have? Uh, <laughs> well, we'll see. We'll see Tuesday. I mean, we'll see with when the pressure comes and all uh, the young guys are in. And uh, I mean, it'll be fun. But I think we have the potential to beat the big teams. I mean, uh, there might be less pressure on us, so that's well, that's a good thing for now. Um, um, I think we need to win. We need to stay in VNL no matter what for the next few few summers, especially for the growth of the program. I think. That's kind of uh, where we want to go, and obviously we want to make the VNL finals and, uh, and 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 do well at Worlds. So, for Worlds, we'll see. We'll see how, how we progress. I think we're going to learn a lot, a lot during VNL with all those international matches, and I think that's going to be really important for for the rest of the summer. How good is it back to be to be back in a Team Canada uniform here in Canada? You guys played last year Nations League, you know, the Olympics and stuff like that, but you didn't get to play here in Canada. You're back here in Ottawa, just across the river from Gatineau. What it's for, what's it like for you to be back here? Uh, I love I love playing here, playing at home. Uh, the crowd is, is the Canadian crowd is so nice. They all, I heard we sold a bunch of tickets, so it's going to be a huge crowd. Uh, a bunch of my friends are coming. A bunch of the older guys are coming too. Like like I know Gore's going to be here. Uh, uh, I think Graham might be coming out. TJ's here. I saw him last night. Like all the guys are going to come back, and it's going to be like an amazing atmosphere. And, and I mean the, the past edi editions here in Ottawa was great, so I think this one's going to be even better. So uh, just being back and playing for Canada is amazing. Awesome, Nick. Best of luck this week and. Uh, See you around. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Thank you. Thanks, guys.